Hi there. As I look out my window today, I am noticing all the different greens that springtime is bringing to Vermont today. And today is Earth Day, so I have a perfect book for today. The name of the book is called Green. And the book is by Laura Vaccaro Seeger. Green. Forest green. See the hole in the page? It's gonna turn into some fish. Sea green. And I see a sea turtle swimming in that green sea. Lime green. When I look at those limes, I think about how juicy they might be and how sour they would taste. And I love that the inside is a light green and the outside is a whole different color green. So many shades of green. Pea green. Some people like them and some people don't, but peas are green. Jungle green. That jungle has olive greens and dark greens and gray greens. And this page says khaki green. Can you see who's hiding? Who's blending in with the khaki green? Mr. Chameleon. Fern green. If you have any ferns outside your house, you can notice how many different greens there are in the ferns and how many different shaped leaves they have too. Oh my gosh, I was gonna say zebra green, but zebras aren't green. This page says wacky green. That is wacky. A green zebra. Slow green. I see something that is very slow and green on that page. Faded green. That's what that sign says. Faded green. All different greens on that page, sort of blue green and limey, yellowy green and mint green, different kinds of greens. This one says glow green. Fireflies, yeah, they look greenish yellow, a different kind of green. Shaded green, beautiful shade trees, and beautiful greens. I can see apples on one of those trees. All green, look at all those green squares with different things inside them. Whoa, it would be so fun to make a paper and divide it into squares and just use green crayons and green crepas and green colored pencils and whatever other kind of green things you could find, green paint and make green shades in the squares. Very cool. Oh yeah, look at this page. It says, never green. A stop sign is never green. I've never seen a green stop sign. Never green. Nope, never. And this page, this reminds me of a few months ago, but nope, no green on this page. No green in the winter. That's why it's so nice to see the green now in the spring. Look at that 
page. Perfect page for Earth Day. The boys planting a green plant. And look, that page says forever green. I wonder if he was planting a tree on that other page and if this is the tree many years later, all grown up. Forever green. And that's the end of the book called Green. I think it would be so fun to go outside and take photographs of all the different green things, green plants, green leaves, green grass, and then print them out and make a book. You could write your own words to it, make your own pages, and have your own green book. Or you could get together green paper, green tissue, green paint, green crepas, green crayons, and make your own very, very, very green collage using all those different fun things. Lots of different things you can do with green. And you can just go outside and enjoy the green springtime. So I hope that's something you do. It was fun to read to you. Bye.